Hello everyone, Sigmalator here. Welcome back to Ghost of Tsushima. Uh, looks like the glitch has finally fixed itself. So with that in mind, where should we go to next? You're done. You're undiscovered. So let's go and discover you and then we'll head back to the dojo. Come, Kage. That's a pair. Oh, another survivor camp. Hello everyone. Hi. What do you want? May Kami protect your path, my lord. My mother believed Inari is my guardian. She saw a fox chasing fireflies outside our home the day I was born. She knew that foxes are Inari's messengers in our world. When you see one, always follow where it leads. I will. Thank you. Alright, so that's just confirming stuff I've learnt. Learnt by doing. Hello, you. What do you have? Sword kits. Oh, yeah, you're, you are primarily. Was it skins, aren't you? Oh, yeah, that's the one I bought before. Vanity gear. Armor dies. Oh, yeah, I own that, I'm just not using it. Right, Toradori's armor. Undiscovered armor. Oh, I haven't done that one yet. Noble Wanderer. Oh yeah, this is the Ronin gear. I'll see you again. Always happy to help. I work metals, woods, and cloth. Okay, our resources. All right. That stuff I can. I'm sorry. I need more for that. Right, so I need to get more resources for those. We next meet, my lord? There's somebody else I could talk to. It's you. Lord Sakai, you must do something. It's Kii Sake Brewery in Azamo. That brewery is the pride of Tsushima. I remember the first time I tried Kii Sake. Soon there will be none left. The Mongols are taking it by force. I'll see what I can do. I thought I already liberated Asamo Asum Bay. Oh, damn it. That's a good boy. Well done, Kage. Right. Undiscovered locations. Oh, blimey, there's quite a few down here. And it survivor camp, okay. Blimey, okay. Well, that's taken care of. Let's go see if we can do some more missions for Quickly cooking. This dude forgot his name there for a moment. Let's head back to his dojo at least. Which is here. Sensei, I have returned. There's something shiny there. You would. I'm not sure what you're for, but I'm sure you're useful. It's okay. Any news of Tomoe? 
Travelers have been shot dead on the roads in and out of Hiyoshi Springs. People are afraid to leave or deliver supplies. You think that's our doing? A few archers at strategic points can isolate a whole town. A tactic of yours when you were Clan Nagao's archery master. Tomoe was a good student. Too good. We're fighting your own reflection. We will turn that to our advantage. The past never passes. Come. How do you propose we find these archers? We think like Tomoe. Do you mean we think like we yourself? We want to control movement in and out of Hiyoshi Springs. Where do we put archers? A handful of men could shut down the road to the coast. Yes. That path behind the inn? No. Poor cover, no clear lines of sight. You want to cover the largest territory with the fewest archers. Uh, okay. I would want someone looking over the bridge into town. So would I. And the last one... I like this. It would be smart to control the main entrance into town. Mm, people already avoid the main road. Archers there would be wasted. Alright, so up here then. The road south runs along a high ridge. Perfect place to rain down arrows. Tomoe would agree. There's hope for you. Let's go hunting. What else did you teach Tomoe? I held back nothing. Including why you left Clan Nago? That's no secret. It was time to retire, and the hot spring suited me. But you continued to teach. Not at first. What changed your mind? The bow is my life. Putting it down felt like death. So I chose to live. But do you regret giving up a warrior's life? Mastery of the bow is mastery of oneself. That is the only victory worthy of a samurai. The rest is noise. Still learning lessons. We're getting close. Eyes open. Even if they are contradictory to what Jin is doing. Can you know from Mongols? Well, there's some dead, some dead horse here and some bodies. I'm right here! Innocent travelers, murdered. Let's help their killers follow them across the south of So we're going to get ambushed several times along this way. All those innocent dead. Tomoe has thrown everything away. Betrayed her people. She is a traitor because the Mongols offer power, wealth, status. Things denied her by birth. Tomoe knew she was born to a lower station than she deserved. Now you're being too kind. Kindness can be useful, even to a warrior. Who told you that? Sun Tzu? My uncle. And he didn't tell me. He showed me. 
Mercy creates a debt. Your uncle showed mercy to people who pose no danger to him. A safe bet. Right, I'm going this way. The arches. Ambush. Hello. Still going this way. Oh, I see. We're going to where the locations we discussed earlier. How do I get over there? Cut through here. They'll be up there somewhere. Well, you've got to be around here somewhere. If you're not too far away. 100 metres. And there they are. How did Tomoe become your student? She showed up at my dojo with her father's makeshift hunting bow and refused to leave. You didn't turn her away? I tried, but she sank arrow after arrow into my targets. I had never seen talent like hers. She must have had training. Her form was wrong. It would have been useless in a real fight. But she had no fear of missing a shot. She never hesitated. A warrior's spirit. No. Killers. I didn't see until it was too late. Draw your blades! Oh, I've taken out one, but I've got no more ammo for the long bow. Bring it on, boys. Sacrifice them, man. Whoa, hello. Oh, 
Ishikawa. You know the name Ishikawa? I do. I have message. Speak. Sensei, all of Hiyoshi Springs will beg for mercy, like the victims of Hironori Naga. Silence! No. Hmm. Sounds like this is a revenge plot. Hironori Nagao. Didn't he die fighting bandits? It was decades ago. He was reputed to be a great archer. Did he study with you? No. Tomoe is spreading lies. But there's a seed of truth. She wants us to doubt each other. We are all that stands between Hiyoshi Springs and a bloodbath. Then we stand together. Hmm. We'll plan the town's defense at my dojo. Meet me there and be ready to fight. Hmm. Doubt. Horse, yes, finally. Your legend grows. The Shadow Samurai. Choose a new ghost weapon. Smoke bomb. Wind chime. Incense mixed with black powder creates thick smoke. Enough to blind my enemies. Excellent. Alright. I can't do any more there. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright. Let's head back. How many more of those do we have to do, actually? God, four or nine. God, there's... There's no lacking for content, that's for sure. Sorry, bluebirds. Oh, Max Sensei. Headband. Optimism in the face of the samurai spirit. I see. Sakai. The way of the bow. We must deal with Tomoe's threat against Yoshi Springs before it's too late. I don't understand a fixation on the town. I was born there. Destroying it proves her worth to the Mongols. And humiliates me. But the terrain works in our favor. Two skilled archers can hold off hundreds. Or we allow the Mongols to take it. Domoe wins a victory and lets her guard down. Then we strike. Sacrifice Hiyoshi Springs for Tomoe. The sacrifice is worth it. Tomoe would agree, Sensei. 
behind Zakai. She will attack from the north. We should focus our efforts there. Scout elevated positions, place arrows, and... Listen! Did you hear that? One arrow, one death. Get myself healed up. All supplies. Grab those. Grab those as well. If the point was to kill us, she would have sent more men. Or the point was not to kill, but to delay. Here she springs. The attack is starting. Alright then, let's go. This way. Hey Kagate, you just stay there. Today. Promise me, you will keep hunting Tomoe. I promise, Sensei. She knows you're my student. Your death will destroy my legacy. Your way of the bow will survive with me. Where will Tomoe strike? In the back town, near the waterfalls, the most vulnerable point. If we get there before the Mongols, we can prepare a defense, but it won't be easy. It never is. I hope he doesn't die, I'd kind of need him to help me rescue Lord Shimura. Oh, hey Kage, how'd you get down here? Oh no, you're not Kage. You two, come here! What is it, my lords? Mongols are heading for Hiroshi Springs. Gather everyone at the inn and stay out of sight. We will deal with them. Yes, my lords. Good sight lines over here. The Mongols won't be able to flank us. We don't have much time. What can we use to our advantage? Not many options. We'll exploit the ones we have. Those barrels could do some damage. Hornets' nests. Excellent distraction. Dry grass. Lure the Mongols in. We'll make sure you have flaming arrows. Take these flaming arrows and try not to burn yourself or me. <laughs> yes. Shot with a half bow, ignites enemies, cloth, and dry grass. Then don't get in my way, Sensei. Get ready. The Mongols will be here soon. They're getting closer. Good. Let's demonstrate the way of the bow for them. They're coming downhill. Take them. One arrow, one death, says they. For more. So are they. Coming down the main road. Ow. I've got them. Just 
No sign of Tomoe. Shoko. More on the way. Help them cross the Tatsu River. now. Right, I'm all stocked back up. No tomorrow, eh? Uh, there she is. That's Tomoe? Burning the Nagao banner. We can catch her. Oh, she'll be long gone by the time we get there. She's a coward. No. She's mocking me. She knows the last student I trained before her was Hironori Nagao. You said he wasn't your student. Which is it? I was young, prideful, callous. Hironori learned from my example. He led a rebellion to seize the clan, and lost, but only after butchering Lord Nagao's best men. Hironori didn't die fighting bandits. That was a story to protect Nagao's legacy. There was no saving mine. As his teacher, I could never be trusted again. I was granted the mercy to resign my position. I convince myself the way of the bow had to survive but the truth is I am a coward who should have ended it long ago you told Tomoya all of this I wanted her to understand what it meant for me to teach again I like everything else she turned it against me. You'll never redeem Hironori Nago. And you won't change Tomoe. But today, you save the people of Hiyoshi Springs. With my new student. I'll need you at Castle Canada. My bow is yours. But Tomoe isn't done yet. We must keep hunting her. We will, Sensei. Oh, good. So, he's now guaranteed to help. That's something, at least. We've still got to take out Tomoe. We've still got to... Uh, help Masako. Yuna's... I think Yuna's mission is all but complete. I've just got to pick up an item from her brother. 
and there's also uh, I've got the Ronin on my side uh, what, what's the other guy's name? Kenji? I think that was his name where is he? Uh, he's down here. Yeah, Kenji. Servants of the people. So I've got a few things to do for him. Oh. Oh, uh, maybe more of his missions will be available once I've... Or is he here? The value of sake. No, that's a different one. Okay, maybe like the rest of that story gets unlocked after a certain point. There's some upgrades available here. <coughs> How do I get down there though? Oh, yeah, I think it's around this way. Yeah, that's one way. And there's someone here to talk to as well. <coughs> Lord Sakai, I think I saw Lady Masako riding for the beach at Komoda. Her husband died there. And her sons. I hear Mongols still hold the beach. I worry for her safety. I worry more for what she'll do to them. But you're right. I shouldn't leave her alone. Oh god, I better go rescue her. Right, as I'm here. Now let's get these upgrades that are here, or at least one of them. Probably around here somewhere. That's the merchant. Ah, never mind. Uh, I think that was closest. Okay. Good boy. Hey. <laughs> Whoa, said it. She hasn't done anything stupid and got herself killed. The more people I have on my side, the better. That was something, I'm not sure what. Masako said to find the monk in charge of this camp. He may be able to read the map I found on the traitor's brother. Oh, yes. Lord Sakai, how good to see you. Junshin, I should have expected to find you here. How may I serve you, my lord? Do you know these lands well? I set up all of these camps. Does this map mean anything to you? We give these to our wagon drivers who deliver food. They mark where the camps are so no one gets missed. Is that blood? Do you see anything that isn't one of your camps? 
I hear rumors of our own people killing each other in Ariake. Traitors are preying on innocent people. They murdered the women and children of Clan Adachi. You can help bring them to justice. This map shows Ariake's lighthouse. We have no camps there, but people have said bandits have taken it over. Not bandits. Something worse. Lady Masako has arrived. I think she prefers to speak with you. Oh, I thought she'd gone to the beach to kill Mongols. What have you learned? The headman of Kuta village might be at the lighthouse. Clan Adachi built that for Ariake. This traitor has no shame. Sado has men protecting him. There's no way they won't see us coming. Good. I want to give that traitor just enough time to fear what's coming. Let's go. Alright. The traitor. Where are we going? That's well, not too far away. Why would Sadao betray you? I accused him of stealing rice. Starving our people to turn a profit. You think he caused the rice shortages that hit Kuta? I could never prove it. But it was such a disaster. I knew he was trying to hide something. Bad men are good at hiding their true natures. Guards outside. The coward is hiding at the top. Sado! I've come for your head! Alright. So it's for going quietly. Wait a moment. Let's go. No it's here. <laughs> 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 Relatively painless. Where am I joining Massacre? Over there. All right. I wonder if this is going to be the last one for a while.
まさか He helped kill everyone I loved And for what? To satisfy his pathetic hatred When the Mongols defeated the samurai I wanted to die with them I threw myself into a battle I knew I couldn't win It was easier How do you survive? I remember that I have people to protect and the dead to avenge. With Sadao dead, whoever is responsible will hear that I'm alive and hunting. They'll become afraid, make a mistake. Just be careful, Masako. You too. You are a part of this now. We'll find the other traitors on that list. But first, we must save my uncle. I'll be at Kaneda Farmstead when you need me. Excellent. So I'm guessing that's all I can do for, with her for now. Excellent. Right. Yeah, she's all done. Ariaki Lighthouse, not complete. Really not complete. Undiscovered location. There's a lot of stuff going on here. Incident at Hiroshi Pass. Let's sort that out. That's my cocky. <coughs> oh, excuse me. One thing I wanted to get done. We'll save you, my boy. Stop it, you animal! My lord! What's happening here? They've taken the bridge! Tell me. We were running for Hiyoshi Springs. The bridge looked safe, but the Mongols were in the ravine. They, they started shooting from below. Someone's injured. Banta! My brother's boy! They're using him as bait. Tell your family to stay clear of the bridge. I'll stop this. Okay. Before I uh, start the mission to save his uncle, one thing I want to do is get all those available side bits cleared up. Keep like... screaming, run! Your family's leaving you to die! Let's go! 
what you get. Arthur! Where are you? Yeah. That's the last of them. Now for boy. Oh, that was relatively painless. You're out there, lad. <coughs> they stop shooting! It is over. Go to your family. Thank you, my lord. The bridge is clear. Good, everyone's safe. The Mongols are gone. Did they scream? Their suffering isn't your concern. Take your family to Hiyoshi Springs. These roads are dangerous. We will. Thank you. Right, what else can I do before we bring this episode to a close? Have a look. All right, so that's all connected to that. We've got you to do, then Yuna. No, nope. so we've still got you to do as well. That's the closest place I can fast travel to, I think. What's this? The value of sake. Oh yeah, I've still got that to do. What's closest to you that I can fast travel to? Probably that. Golden birds. Really to... okay. Without you, boy. Absolutely. Let's go see what's going on with this uh, musician. Yeah, the heavenly strike. That's the one. Susano, protect me! Bodies. What happened here? <coughs> Who killed these people? A fearsome warrior. He demanded I tell him the tale of Shigenori's heavenly strike. When he didn't hear the answers he sought, he flew into a rage and butchered them. What did he want to know? I am not sure, my lord. Tell me the story. I need to know what he's after. When Tsushima was first settled, a strange and terrible thunderstorm swept across our island. Wherever lightning struck, beasts of lightning appeared. These violent creatures tore through villages, causing death 
and destruction, moving too quickly to be stopped. The people knew only one man who could possibly stand against the lightning beasts. Shigenori, the fastest swordsman in all of Tsushima. Shigenori never lost a duel. With years of practice, he had created the Heavenly Strike, an attack that struck quicker than the eye could follow. Shigenori lured the creatures to a desolate beach in Komatsu, where the sand would slow their movement. Their clash turned the sand to ash and bleached the leaves of trees white. Shigenori's heavenly strike cut through them faster than they could move. As the final beast fell, the storm cleared and Tsushima was safe again. Shigenori began a life of seclusion. Few students found him, and only the bravest and most skilled proved worthy of learning the heavenly strike. When a storm approaches, a sword is placed at Shigenori's rest by a student who knows of its location to ward off attacks from beasts of nature. Hmm. The murderer wishes to learn Shigenori's heavenly strike. It sounds dangerous in the wrong hands. Which way did he go? A woman fled toward a nearby bridge. He chased her. He'll answer for what he did here. All right. The search for the heavenly strike begins, but we shall see its conclusion in the next episode. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this, guys. If you liked it, like, subscribe, ding that bell. I've been Sigma Later. This has been Ghost of Tsushima. And I'll catch you next time. Take care now.